Morpho Detection does uh, explosive detection systems uh, for homeland security, uh, airport, or the luggage that you uh, check into the airport. Uh, we scan it. We make sure that uh, you don't have any explosives or items of interest. In our systems, uh, CT systems, we do, uh, we, they consist of a gantry that rotates at a certain RPM and uh, we use x-ray to detect all the components inside of the bag or luggage and uh, we use uh, computers to uh, figure out you know, their densities or what are they made of. And we also use the conveyor system to move the bags uh, through the system. I've been with using ANSI simulation systems from the beginning. I have used other products, but uh, I don't get quite the result that I want. Uh, so I, we choose ANSI just, to, um, just for its performance. What I do is I take the structure of the model that I lay out and uh, I bring it into a workbench and do simulations, uh, centrifugal uh, rotation or, or G-forces. Re-optimizing uh, structures, uh, we have seen uh, a, a reduction on the uh, system weight that uh, actually have enabled us to put uh, other components into the system. Uh, it has optimized our, our uh, balancing when you have a big load uh, on the rotation. Balancing plays a key, a key role. Now our systems are easier to balance because we exactly know where the, 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 the weight is and the centrifugal forces. So. so it has played a big role in bringing us to the next level. In our system, we have been using ANSYS to model the structure and uh, we are looking for opportunities on where to use it in other places. I think in the past, uh, we haven't used a simulation software to do our systems. So, and you can actually see that in our uh, legacy systems. In our legacy systems, uh, you see a lot of extra uh, steel or a lot of uh, extra parts that are probably not adding to the uh, structure. In our new, newer systems, we, just because we are able to uh, simulate and understand how the stresses are uh, placed or are handled by the, by the, by the structure, we're able to optimize and, and minimize the, the components in it. Balancing plays a big part of our uh, systems as we have this uh, heavy gantry piece rotating at 100 and something RPMs. And ANSYS has uh, helped us, taking us to the ne next level by reducing the weight and optimizing the construction of it. Mm -hmm.